Hello, friends. This is Dave Hurwitz, executive editor at ClassicsToday.com, here with an absolutely gorgeous disc of Massenet Songs with Orchestra. Now, here's something you probably haven't heard, and there's quite a ton of them. There's a lot of these suckers. Let me see how many there are. Um, oh, my. Well, let me see. Oh, we got a beautiful booklet. It's wonderful. Uh, okay. Here they are. Oh, there we go. There's 25 of them. I mean, most of them are quite brief. They run from like two and a bit minutes to up to like four or five minutes. And they are just amazing. You know, Massenet, of course, was a fabulous orchestrator. And his music is lyrical and yummy and luscious. And there's a lot of harp in here, of course, because it's French. And, and he, he didn't write song cycles. Most French composers of the day did not write song cycles, but they wrote many orchestral songs. The original version of Saint-Saëns' Danse Macabre is one. Berlioz wrote, wrote a whole slew of them. I mean, he, he grouped together six of them as Les Nuits d'été, but originally they were written individually for different singers, and sometimes the work is still performed that way. And the same is true of Massenet. So here we have one, two, three, four, five, six singers. Six singers, Jody Devos, Cyril Dubois, Véronique Jean, she's the most famous name here, Étienne Dupuis, Nicole Carr, and Chantal Santon Geoffrey, with the Orchestre de Chambre de Paris under Hervé Niquet. And the label is the Palazzetto Bruzzane. Bruzzan, you know, those, they're in Italy actually, but. The pilot said it, but it's Bruzzane, Bruzzane, I don't know how you pronounce it, Bruzzane, if they do it in French or in Italian, I don't care. It's B-R-U-Z-A-N-E. That's what it is. Do not tell me. Don't tell me. I don't want to know. I don't care. That's it. Okay. So, you know, they've done an enormous series of unusual French operas and things like that. Um, and we're going to cover a lot of that stuff at some point. I'm getting to it. I'm getting to it. I have them all sitting in a shelf. So, yes, we will get there. But this is a, a single disc release. They are scholarly productions, um, often done in association with the publication of critical editions of the works in question. You get beautiful booklet notes with, with complete texts and translations, French to English. Um, really just first class product of a kind that we seldom see anymore. It's really true. And, I mean, this is readily available. It's distributed in the United States by Naxos. You can find this stuff. But the songs are just lovely. Lyrical, attractive, sweet. Most of them, you know, very, very, you know, sensitive, sentimental, yes. But, uh, you know, I mean, what's not to love? If you like orchestral song settings, like Mahler's Desknob and Wunderhorn, for example, or something like that. We have a pile of orchestral songs that are not, strictly speaking, a cycle, but rather just a group of wonderful orchestral songs. You should have the Massenet songs. The sonics are marvelous. The playing is terrific. The singing, my goodness, these are all really, really good singers. I mean, there's not a weak voice in the crew, and they've really tried to do it as as idiomatically and authentically, and I don't mean that in the HIP sense, I mean authentically in the sense of finding the right voice type for each song and arranging the songs in a, in a, in a sensible program. I mean, I just put this thing on and just lay there and went, ah, with my tongue hanging out. Well, your tongue may not hang out, but your ears will. I guarantee it. So give this a shot. You will be extremely glad that you did. Um, it's it's, it's a special and wonderful release of truly unique and interesting repertoire. The complete Massenet songs with orchestra. Well, I don't know if they're all complete, but it's a lot of them. 25 of them, let's just say. 66 minutes and 40 seconds on one CD. Go for it. Take care. Keep on listening. And thank you for giving me a chance to tell you about this splendid disc.